Hello, I'm Kevin, and this is The Real Way to Make Money Online. This week is all about Tee Public. Should you upload to Tee Public? Tee Public doesn't get the traffic Amazon gets. It's even behind Redbubble in terms of traffic. So, why bother? Because it gets a lot of traffic, and it's growing. Redbubble has a problem with thieves and tag spammers, and they aren't doing anything about the tag spammers. So I stopped uploading there. I have a link in the description below for Tee Public. If you use that link, you'll help me feed my daughter and her cat. And now her puppy, too. The little one and a half pound teacup Yorkie eats more than the 15 pound cat. Dude is a machine. Jesus. Redbubble. Redbubble is too much to deal with for the amount of sales I was getting, which was very few. I get more sales in a month on Tee Public than I've got all year on Redbubble. So, what are my numbers? I've been averaging around $14 to $25 a month on Tee Public. But last month brought in $75. I was kind of happy. That's not bad with only 150 designs. Now I've got I me. Mean, now I've got almost 200 uploaded, and uh, I need to get a lot more, especially uh, Q4 coming. I want a lot. I need to get all my my uh, everything that sells on Everything that sells on Amazon, I need to get over to Tee Public. Most of them are already there, but certainly not all. Some things to consider. The first thing you want to do is go to account. You know, after you uh, after you uh, create your account, anyway. Okay, so Tee Public. It's not like it's not like Amazon. Or uh, even Redbubble, and a few others. There's things you got to do before your designs are searchable. You can't just upload, start making money. You can, but you got to do a few things first. So, from my account, you want to go to. So you want to go to Edit Storefront, and from there. You'll need to add your storefront name. It's got to have a name. Uh, it will give you a slug for uh, creating links. So you can send people to your store. If you don't like what they give you, you can change it. Then uh, you'll want a brief bio. Mine is two sentences long. I hide the store name for a reason. Uh, you have a banner and an icon. The store name uh, shows over the banner and it just doesn't look nice. Uh, let's see, do not hide your avatar. That's the square icon. And then they have social links. So uh, you just need one. You can add all of them if you want but you only need one. Then from there you go to view my storefront and you'll have your banner which mine will be blurred so you <laughs> can't find my store and see all my designs. But up in the top right corner of the banner It'll say upload new. You gotta hover over it. And it'll say upload new cover photo. Make something real nice or go to Fiverr and have someone else make it. Uh, I made my own. It seems to do just fine. The dimensions for the banner is 1100 by 310 pixels. The icon or avatar here same thing uh, hover over it and uh, click upload the uh, click upload new icon 
and that one is 324 by 324 pixels again. And the last thing you want to do to make your design searchable is upload 25 designs. You have to have at least 25 designs before any of them will be searchable. Now I didn't know that when I first uh, signed up and it actually took a while before I got 25 uploaded. Um, yeah, they'll send you an email. They will say people get more sales when they have at least 25 designs. Well, yeah, I guess so if you're only uh, making them searchable after 25. Once you get all that done, your designs are searchable and you start making money. Which is what we're all here for, right? So, uh, let's see. There's no tiers on T Public. You can upload as many as you want. Um, which is kind of sad. I only have 187. Uh, Amazon is my priority. Uh, another thing I've heard you can only upload, or only, huh, 50 per day. Now that, uh, 36 I uploaded took three hours so I couldn't imagine doing 50 so I can't confirm if 50 is a limit or not it's just what I heard so uh, the upload process it's it's a process it's uh, not as easy as Amazon or quick it's not as quick as Amazon but it's a lot quicker than Redbubble and uh, you're not going to be able to see this, but when you're on my storefront, you'll see your designs. And they have an edit, copy, and deactivate. On copy, so once you get to copy settings, you can copy the scale and placement, which is very nice. If you've got... Uh, I put all my designs in the same spot so I can do scale and placement on more than just TeePublic. Uh, I used it in Redbubble when I was uploading there too. Your secondary tags. Enabled products. Product colors, also important. Description and primary tag. I'll get to primary tag in another video. That'll probably be that will probably be next week. Uh, but you have primary and secondary, and then you continue to the uploader. So I think that's it for this week. Okay, next week I will show you the upload process, including these primary secondary tags. I think they call the main tag when you upload. So I'll see you next time. That's it for this video. If you made it to the end, let me know in the comments. If you like what you saw, leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you next time.